Hello, good to see you all here. We're going to take questions one at a time. Please be patient. You'll all get a turn. Okay, guys, uh, we've got to wrap it up now. Thanks so much for attending. The man of the moment. A free-scoring performance when last we saw him. How about on this occasion? Next on EA TV. And all systems go here at Anfield ahead of what should be an enthralling night of football. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from Europe's Premier Club competition. This, the league phase. It is Liverpool facing Galatasaray. Well, Liverpool, I thought, looked a very good team in their opening game. They really deserved their win. But can they back it up with another performance here? It should be a decent game. Mo Salah. He's in with a chance. A truly yeah, very good. Start. One minute. An early goal in the game. Just what they were hoping to produce. Yeah, they had been worried for a couple of days when you know, the case didn't come in initially. Yeah. So but to drop the shoulder. at least and when he gets know, it's, onto it, he it is arrived now, so, and makes so all this is all good. That's a top -class I guess hopefully it doesn't happen again. Nicolo Zaniolo read it well it's a good Liverpool move in the making and options in the centre oh, it might be well a vital interception Ooh. to snuff out the danger ok where can I go where can I go Harvey Elliott but he tried in vain to get himself back oh. onside. Well, he needs to show greater awareness there and hold on to the ball a fraction longer. Yeah, most of him was offside. It's all right. I'm in the lead. I'm in the lead. Gabriel Sara deserves credit for winning the ball back. Kedri. Liverpool have given it away. And to play it goes. He was under a bit of pressure. So aggressive. Alexis McAllister. And with that, the attack fizzles out. That. Nicolo Zaniolo. Pedri. Well, how about that for a piece of tackling to break things up? Oof. Oh, wrong direction. Torreira. Now with Sara. Liverpool have given it away. 
But a goal to update you on. It's gone in in the City game. And Alex Scott has the details. It's a goal for Real Madrid. They're the first on the score sheet here with 19 minutes played. What a fascinating matchup we have here today, Derek. Oh, no, Alex no, no, keeping no. us right up to date. Oof. Ball back with wrong. Galatasaray now. Nicolò Zaniolo. Hey, where can I go? Minch. Now Mo Salah. Ugh. That's right. Very quick thinking there. No, 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 that's, that's not right. Gabriel Sara. Wonderfully weighted pass. This could be the equaliser. Oof. Pedri. And the defenders know they need to get tighter. So violent. Salah. Salah. He's got to score! And it's oh. in for Liverpool. Mm, Is there a way back for the opposition now? Well, as you can see, he gave the keeper no chance there. He looked so confident, didn't he? That's a cool finish. Yeah, so for shopping tomorrow, I'm intending on, on getting a new PSU. Something more more highly Back rated and more fast to, to replace the one I'm currently using. Right, just hearing the situation has changed in the Leverkusen game, and Alex Scott has the details. Yeah, it's a goal for Leverkusen. It's now 1 0 with 33 minutes played. Alex with the info as ever. Good ball over the top, and clears the danger. And Martin Buica has it now. Nicolo Zaniolo and Galatasaray unable to hang on to the ball and a long way out here oh goodness gracious me it's a special special goal from miles out Well, just look at the that strike again. Crazy. He hits it so well. That's a great bit of skill. No wonder he's pleased with himself. It sailed through the air and just curled and bent all the way into the far top corner. Goalkeeper had no chance. Blistering first half display, and just look at that score. Yelat. Good looking pass. Determined defending. Well, we're shortly going to hear the half time whistle. Uh -oh. It's Liverpool on top, and Stuart, they've been impressive. Well, what a total dominant performance this has been so far. They're attacking players. Can he put it away? Looking for someone to play it to. Well, very oh. effective goalkeeping to touch it over. Yeah, that PSU I wanted, I, I plan on getting. I, I think I showed you a picture of it. Yeah, slowly upgrading parts. Uh, the ones that are, the ones that are necessary. Short corner it is. This looks interesting. Still looking to get the shot off. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger.
He's driven in the corner. And making sure it wasn't problematic. And that brings to an end the first half here at Anfield. Yeah, given the rate at which I'm, I'm replacing and upgrading the parts, say, Stuart, it most feels Salah as if quite a lot I to say for himself out there on the pitch. Well, what can you say about it today? He's been a real live wire, myself. full of tricks, great feet, and good goals as well. Top stuff. Where there's almost nothing left of, of the original computer that I bought about a year ago. <laughs> Plus, like I, I've already replaced the, well, already replaced the, the case and the fans, and I also replaced the. I also replaced my, my graphics card earlier this year. Although the, the original graphics card that I had was was a was a second hand one that that my, that my sister gave me. Well, Galatasaray a bit wasteful in possession. Yeah, I did. I bought it new about yeah, just a, just a little over a year ago, in fact. Demir Bai has it. Technique displayed. Well, nothing comes of it. It looked promising. But I'm hearing the situation has changed in the City game. Alex Scott is going to tell us more. And it's his second. Oh, he's done it! But hang on. Offside is the verdict here. It's not going to stand. Well, you can tell he thought he was onside here. But the assistant, I think, got it absolutely right. Yep, he's offside. It does, yeah. You know, just you know, just when you you know, just when you think well, you know, Alex was in full flight. You've you gotten Alas, used to, to cut her off just moments you know, whatever, ago. Whatever computer just specs you have, City did score in that game. You've gotten comfortable with it, etc. And boom, in comes the next generation of specs. Mm. Depends. Uh, like, like, can I say for the time? Well, here's being, another look, and you can you know, see the, what a good finish the new this PSU is. My, he holds off the defender brilliantly and upgrade. keeps his composure. That's a great goal. Well, then there's probably nothing going on for a few months, so then maybe there might be a game or two here or there, you know, or or something, something on discount you know, for cheap that I could buy. You know, and because I know that there are some old titles contest, you know, that I would be interested in you know, and if they're available for cheap just a reminder you know, I can, we I can have get more some absorbing action from the Premier League coming your way here on EA TV it's Liverpool taking on Leicester City Could be. and maybe that's right spot on with that tackle And he has options available. Mo Salah, well, he loves to do this. Cut in off the flank. And the shot just over the top. Mm. Well, I know that I will gradually want to play the, you know, the, the Trails series. I am currently still, you know, still playing uh, Trails in the Sky 3. So there's there's gonna be more you know more of the trails games you know, in in future in due time. And they will make the change now. Nelson, but a goal to update you on. So He's yeah, gone in the I, city I've, had, game I've replaced my Scott case and fans. Yeah, I replaced a second-hand GPU with, with, the, with the brand new one earlier this year. Many thanks, Alex. So next, if I replace the 
plays the PSU. Oh, great attacking play. And then, then what's next? Uh, at some point, maybe replacing the motherboard and the CPU, but maybe. And if that happens, I'll have basically replaced the whole computer, I think. Except, so as, except for you know, the storage drives, I think. And Galatasaray come away with it. So it's funny how these things happen. So it's, it's like you know, when you when you gradually replace it piece by piece, then then all of a sudden you, you, know, you eventually realize after the fact that now you, know, you have replaced the whole, replaced the whole computer as a whole new thing altogether. And successfully cut out. And now a throw in. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match. Coming onto the pitch, number 14, Wilfred Zaha. Into the final 20 minutes. Given it away. What kind of pass was that? That's right. Gabriel Sara. And Zaha has it. Hmm. Between, between storage and Terrific DLC, I would block. say prioritize the DLC. At least that's my thoughts. So, Boss Lloyd. Decent looking pass. No nonsense clearance. Well, no way no, through. Where was that going? Okay. Just keep Virgil calm. Van Dijk. Uh. McAllister. Opportunity! Oh, <laughs> Alrighty. Good luck at work and thanks for stopping by. Well, here it is again. The through ball is Catch wonderfully you later. executed. While the movement in the box is equal to it, it's such good timing. What a goal. Nunes with a tap in, and now we beat 5 0. If there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Oh. And the Liverpool throw in forthcoming. Well, nearly at full time, not quite, and it's all going Liverpool's way, Stuart. Well, the result has never really been in doubt, has it? They've created so many chances with some brilliant attack in play. I think they've looked an outstanding team today. And I'm hearing that something has happened in the City game. Let's hear all about it from Alex. It's a goal for Real Madrid. The goalkeeper did all he could, but no one was going to stop that one. They're back in this now with 86 minutes on the clock. Alex with the info as ever. NCT 3 1 at 3. Could be dangerous. Using a strength to shield the ball. Well, that's the end of that move for now. That's a lovely ball. That was a very good target man header well, by Nunes. Look at this again. You're the winning that header and setting so the Chiesa free down on the left wing. And then Chiesa reciprocates and with the square pass, finish in the end. Nunes with an open goal tapping.
Well, it's an out and out pasting. 6 0. And the referee is going to add on three minutes. Well, they win the throw following that challenge. Yeah, the fans are happy. Galatasaray couldn't keep it. Oops. Okay, full time, full time, full time. Yeah. And the referee blows for full time. This goes down as a Liverpool victory. Well, another excellent result, and it's the perfect start. Of course, they're not through yet, but another good performance, and they'll surely make the knockout stages. Well, as performances go, that was a brilliant display from Darwin Nunez. Stuart, your assessment. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today. Some questions regarding the match. That'll be all, thank you. Cameras trained on one man. He makes goal scoring look easy, as evidenced by his recent record. This is EA TV. Well, the rain has been lashing down in the build-up to the game, and it's still lashing down here at Anfield. I'm Derek Ray, and my commentary partner here on the gantry is the former Arsenal and West Ham player, Stuart Robson. And looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League coming right up. It is Liverpool versus Leicester City. Well, I'm excited by this encounter today. Both teams have a good game plan, both teams can be physical, and both teams have creative players. It could be a case of who wants it more. Alexander Arnold. He takes aim. It was on its way in. So the starting lineup for Liverpool. Alisson begins in goal. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Ibrahima Konate in central defence. And getting the vote of confidence in attack today, Mohamed Salah. Oh, when all was said and done, Stuart, he wasn't a million miles away. No, he wasn't, because he generates so much power from that sort of distance. His technique is brilliant. Interception to snuff out the danger. Well, when Liverpool are on their game defensively, they don't give their opponents very much of a look in. And the stats back that up, Stuart. Well, they've been so solid at the back, whether it's in front of their own fans or away from home. I think it comes down to communication. They're just so well drilled and organised. Hopefully for the neutrals, they do concede the first one today. Oh, the flag has gone up. Offside. Offside. I think it was offside by how much? A, a toe. Hamza Chowdhury. And it's with Wagnerman. Oh, 
Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. Well, pass after pass, maybe they can chisel an opportunity. Oh, great block. Mm. And teammates around him. Alexander Arnold. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. Well, trying to probe, yes. but not succeeding. Winks. Back now to the goalkeeper. Thomas. Now with Fass. Luke Thomas. Harry Winks now. How, how did he feel the ball? Well, there? Leicester couldn't keep it. Can he put them in front? Well, the keeper ah. had plenty to think about with bodies around him. The pass was over hit. Well, he really read that brilliantly. Williams had all sorts of space, space you know, ahead of him and around him. But the pass was just way over hit. Who knew the goalkeeper? Cheshko. Leicester struggling to hang on to the ball. Nice looking move, this. Salah. Rewarded for that brilliant high press. This match is just not going well at all. Promising possession, this. Oh, right in the nick of time. Oh. Oh, simple for the keeper. Might jump in front. Oh, a goal! What and was the goalkeeper the doing there? Of a dreadful mistake by the goalkeeper. Here it is again, and you have to say, he looks so uncomfortable with the ball at his feet. He's cost his team a goal here. The goalkeeper literally rolled the ball to Williams, and Williams just had... He still had a bit of, a bit of an acute angle to try, and, to try and score from, but he made it. And the Foxes get us moving again. A swift reply required after the setback. Benjamin Sheshko. Now with Mavididi. Encouraging move from Leicester. But the danger averted for now. Constantinos Simikas. So Bosloy. Pedri. The supporter. And he's made headway. Just what the Liverpool fans wanted to see as they extend the lead to two goals. Well, just watch this again. Salah's pass is inch perfect. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. Well, back to the drawing board, I'm afraid. His team have been really poor today. He finally moved the so daylight. back underway with the lead standing at 2-0. there it is. Isahaku. Will it happen for them? Leicester are still capable of being a threat on the counter, especially with the striker the that they have. the challenge that was required. Mm. 
Ceszko. Fass. Now with Fatawu. He'll take it away. He won the ball. Might work out. Ambitious effort. Oh, oh he's on the corner. Perfect. Well, let's see this again. The vision to play this through ball is superb, and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. That through ball from Pedri was just perfectly weighted. And the first time shot, that was, that was when that went up and just dipped down. Dipped down enough. So over the goalkeeper's arms, well, Pick you've got to say, goal, an incredible first half performance. That corner. score line tells yes. you all you need to know. Oh, that was perfect. Steffi Mabadidi. Ceszko. Harry Winks now. Well, that's common sense refereeing to play advantage. And a promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end. So there goes the half-time whistle, and so far, so good for Liverpool. They hold the lead. Well, before the game, we talked about their defensive record, but it's the forwards who have been still in the limelight today. They've been so sharp, plenty of movement, and if the first half is anything to go by, I can see there being more goals in the second half. And so the ball is rolling again, and Leicester are left with a mountain to climb here in the second half. Can they respond? He's got to have a go here. Ooh. Well, the shot seems a like shot. a good option, but goalkeeper's ball. Mabadidi. Luke Thomas. Harry Winks now. Well, they have the ball once more. And nicely over the top. Must score! In it goes! <laughs> Such a complete <laughs> the performance! Goal. Four in front now! What was the meaning of that? The goalkeeper literally moved out of the way, all the way off the field, and just, and just gave Williams an open goal to shoot that. What happened well, here? it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. Yeah, look, where was the goalkeeper? He walked off the field. Well, that's not a happy manager. He knows he's got a lot of work to do now. A lopsided contest, 4-0. Winks. Luke Thomas. And snuffing out the danger. Just a quick reminder, we have more action from the Premier League coming your way. It's Liverpool facing Crystal Palace. So Bosloy. It's a neat move. Thomas. On to Mavididi. And it's gone out of play under real duress. Pedri. And on to Alexander Arnold. Setting off perhaps a little bit too much here. Determined defending. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. Winks could be threatening. He's just got to continue his run. Mm. Oh, that's a fine save. Again, that, that was a, perf a perfectly weighted through ball for. Well, just to point you in the right through. direction, we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here shot. on EA TV. It's Leicester City facing Southampton. Well, the fixtures are coming thick and fast. It should be a good game. That hopefully I've not just given it the commentator's curse. Promising 
sequence. And unable to hang on to the ball. That's good pressing for you. Okay. Time to make some changes. Okay. Bring on Elliot. And give Bradley some game time as well. So that's that's five changes, I think. And Liverpool come away with it. Overcook that one. Ooh. Yeah, overcook this right. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. Now options are plenty. That's a foul. That's a foul. Dropping challenge, and the referee has got to have a big think about it. Yeah. And following the infringement, a caution. Yeah, no surprise there. That was always going to be a booking. Yeah, yellow card, and rightly so. Available. Free kick, free kick. Uh, no one, huh? Okay, right. so the win is that way. Uh, too much on that. Excellent strike! Considering the position of that free kick, that was an outrageous effort. So close. Well, it's a great strike, but just not quite the accuracy he was looking for. Yeah, not enough bend on that one. Don't worry, goalkeeper. Take the time you need. You're losing 4 0 anyway. Pass. Risky play. Did well to clear it away. No. Credit to them for winning back possession. What kind of a pass was that? Long target. Vagnoman. Well, he's certainly not alone. Fatawu Isahaku. Showing good defensive judgment. Pedri. And this is Diogo Jota now. Oops. Really fine bad. piece of defending play to break us up. Jota. A goal! Just a minute. They're really being spoiled. This is attacking football at its finest. Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him. Once that Leicester player with the ball was under pressure, and then for two of the Liverpool players, he had nowhere to go, nowhere, no one to pass to, yeah, and just like that, gave, gave away the ball in a very dangerous area. Jota was open in the middle of the box, and lots of space, no one near him. Yet all the oh time my goodness, in the world, so all the space of the world, this match. the biggest spot. Score the goal. Hamza Chowdhury. Fatawu Isahaku. On to Chowdhury. Beautiful pass. Chance to finish. Ooh. Didn't catch it badly. But certainly questions to be asked about the lack of accuracy there. No. Question should be asked about the defence and the fact that and a substitution he managed to run between the, the two centre backs and no one was able to challenge him. That's the question that should be asked. Ibrahima Konase. Ten minutes left for play. Harvey Elliott. Pedri. And he read it superbly.
Might lead to a chance. And nicely struck. Ooh. Well, it turned out to be fairly routine for the keeper in the end. Johan Wiesa. And quick thinking defensively. Williams. And teammates around him. That didn't go as a plan in the end. Yeah, just crowded out there. Far too many players surrounding him. Has gone up here. Offside. Offside. The decision. Offside. And a double substitution no panic. it's going to be. No panic. It's okay. You're leading five minutes. No need to panic. Nothing to panic. And a good challenge Ooh. to bring that attack to an end. And the counter attack is on. Options available. The electronic board has been held in the air, and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. And a throw in for Leicester City. Vestergaard. And it's with Wagnermann. Winks. Luke Thomas. Harry Winks now. And a timely intervention. He's in here. Oh. And that is all for this game anyway. It goes into the books as a victory for Liverpool. Well, they've been great defensively, as we know. But it was all about their front players today. Their movement, awareness of space and speed of thought was just too much for their opponents. They could have won this by a lot more. No further questions, thank you.